Hi, I'm Paul from Keogh Construction. I'm in one of our homes today. This home was built to be passive and built to be resilient. I'm here to talk to you about our wall construction. It's, it's one of our systems we like to use on this type of build. Um, starting from the outside, we like to use, I'm a big fan, you'll notice, um, of uh, rock wool insulation. So starting from the outside, we're using a comfort board. So it acts as a, as a barrier. It's a great product because it, it um, will uh, absorb moisture, but it'll also dry. Uh, in behind that, we have a Madge Vest. So it's a product um, that we use as a house wrap. It's, it's a water and an air barrier. And with it, uh, we use the SIGA tape, which is really a great product. So what we have in the cross section is our two by six wall. So this is our structural wall. On this wall, uh, we do on this one as being a bungalow, we do, we do go to a two foot center on the studs, which will give us more insulation and less, and less lumber, um, which is good. So in that wall cavity is an R24 rock wall insulation that will have nothing in it. There'll be no mechanical running through it. And you'll see why when, again, when we look at the cross section, that's our exterior wall. We move to the inside and this, we have a half inch air barrier. We don't want anything touching. We don't want any kind of thermal bridging. Our exterior board out here definitely helps with the thermal bridging. And then this is just an added feature as well. We'll stagger our studs on the interior wall. And what we have is a two by four interior wall. In this cavity, we run our mechanical, so our electrical, our plumbing, um, any kind of uh, HVAC um, wiring will run through here. It's also good for future use because when we look at the drywall, if a homeowner run, wants to run any more cabling or run anything in the wall, when they do that or you know, when they hang something on there, they're not penetrating our, our membrane. So our membrane does not get compromised at all. So our, Mar our Madge Rex, which is the product we use, everything runs on the outside. Inside our mechanical wall is an R14 rock wall as well. So that completes our system. It's a very airtight system, but also what's important to us is that it also lets the, the wall breathe. With the material we use, if there's any kind of moisture, then it can, it can escape.